Hi guys, it's Lizzie. So this is going to be my July wrap up. You are going to notice it's going to cut part way through. I I'm having to film part of this video before I leave school, so in the middle it's going to cut and the second half of all the books that I read in the month of July are going to go up. At this point that I'm filming this video, I have read 14 books, which is insane, and I know that I have more I'm going to be reading because I'm participating, I've participated in one readathon and I'm planning to participate in another. So. A lot of books are being read, which is fantastic. So let's get right in. The first book that I read in the month of July was Petals on the Wind by V.C. Andrews. This is the second in the Doll Gangers series, or the sequel to Flowers in the Attic. I did not like this book as much as I did Flowers in the Attic. I only gave it, I think, 2.5 out of 5 stars. I do have a separate video filmed of this. Of, uh, I do have a separate review filmed of this that should already be up, so I will link it on the screen as well as down in the uh, drop down bar if you want to hear my thoughts on that just because this video is already going to be so long so I'm not really going to go in depth on any of these books, but not going to continue the series. <laughs> then I picked up In Real, nope, then I picked up Inside Out by Jack Kearney. I gave this 3 out of 5 stars in the end. Um, originally I gave it 2.5 out of 5 stars and ended up talking with the author, Jack, uh, about a couple of the things that I had in my review, said that I actually had misunderstood, so my review changed slightly, my rating, because he explained where he was coming from with some things. Uh, so I do have a review filmed of that, but my better reviews, actually if you go check out my Goodreads or, yeah, if you go check out my Goodreads, my updated reviews on there, but I will link that video if you want to check that out. Next I participated in the A Yearathon July Readathon, which was getting through books on your TBR, and I decided to do a little bit different than just reading books on my TBR, because I don't really have a set TBR, so I just worked on bumping my year goal up by reading more books. So I ended up picking up a bunch of graphic novels. I do have a wrap-up filmed of this where I talk about all these books in depth. So if you want to go check that out, I will, again, link it on the screen and down in the info bar. But the books that I read during that was In Real Life by Cory Doctorow and Jen Wang, Twilight Volumes 1 and 2 and New Moon Volume 1, The Terrible and Wonderful Reason Why I Run Long Distances by The Oatmeal, Sagas Volume 1 through 3 by Brian K. Vaughn and Fiona Staples, Gingerbread Girl by Paul Tobin and Colleen Coover, and Ghost Worlds by Daniel Klaus. Also during the Yearathon, I started You're Never Weird on the Internet Almost by Felicia Day, and ended up finishing this after I finished the Readathon. I gave this book 5 out of 5 stars, and I do have a full review that is either up at the time this video goes up or is gonna go up, so if it's up, I'll link it on the screen. And if it isn't, I'll put the link down in the info bar after it is up. And now the rest of the books that I read in the month of July are... So that was my July wrap-up. I know I read an insane number of books. If you participated in any of the readathons that I participated in, or just if you want to let me know what you read in the month of July and what your favorite book was, feel free to put it down in the comments. If you liked this video, make sure to click that thumbs up button or if you like the fact that I read so many books because for once it wasn't that I made an insane TBR and then just didn't read any books. So click that thumbs up button. And if you would like to see other videos that I put up or reviews of any of the books that were in this video, make sure to click that subscribe button because then you'll get all five videos that I put up a week usually Monday through Friday, in your subscription box, and I will talk to you in my next video. Bye!